Hi, welcome to the full stack development with Angular 8 and Spring Boot. In this video, we are going to create an entity for category table. Let's begin. I'll go to the entity package and create a new class. I'm going to call this book category. Click finish. The category table contains two columns. Let's define those fields, private, long, id, private, string, category name. Let's add annotations. So what I'll do is I'll go to the book.java and I'll copy the annotations and I'll paste it here. Let me change the table name tbl underscore category and I'll copy the at id and add generated value annotation and I'll paste it here and I'm going to add a add column annotation and I'll specify the column name category underscore name Let me import the add column annotation. All right. So now let's define the relationship. So if you look at the database design, so we have a two tables, table underscore book, table underscore category. So the many books will belongs to one category. In the same way, one category belongs to many books. So let's define this relationship, which is a one to many relationship. I'll go to the book.java and in the down I'll create some white space let's define a field private and many books belongs to one category so book category and I'll define the field name as category and I'll add annotation at many to one And I'll add the annotation add join column. And I'll specify the column name, which is category underscore ID. And this column should not be null. So I'll specify nullable is equal to false. Let's import these annotations. So let's remove these white space. All right, let's save this. Now let's go to the book category. Let's define a field for list of books. Private, we're going to use a set interface, which is of type book. And the field name book let's import this from the util package and I will add annotation one to many so one category belongs to many books cascade type dot all and map it by we have to specify the column name or the field name which we are mapping with okay in this case it's category let me import this let's fix this error cascade is equal to all right so let's save this so now we have defined the one to many relationship between these two entities. In the next video, we're going to create a repository for these two entities. So that is coming up in the next video. I will see you in the next video. Thanks for watching. And don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel and click the bell icon to get notified whenever I upload a new video.